Say hello. Hello. All right. So what are we doing today? Uh, a transformer. Transform. Kind of. Kind of. Yep. So we're going to go over the, the generator switch, right? Okay. All right. So. So. Here is our generator switch. Uh -huh. um, so say power goes out for the whole house. Um, yeah. This is our main breaker switch. We're going to just go ahead and turn everything off. So we have no power in the house right now. So uh, now I'm going to go ahead and turn off all of our breakers. So our power is out. Yeah. Nothing is working. Um, all right, so everything is off. Yeah, you got one one little man kind of upset about it. Hey, hey, how are you? Hey. Hi. <laughs> Appreciate it. All right, so out here we have our generator, generator switch. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and fire it up and do a little a little demonstration. Let's see if I can remember how to turn it on. Hey, go. Hold on. Yeah, on. Hold on. Oh, a little bit wants to push it. Hold on. Push it one more time. Push it one more time. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Push it. It'll start. got the generator all hooked up uh, so now we're gonna want to turn the generator switch on so this brings power from the generator to our breaker so you once you hit that switch bam so from this point um, now that you have now that you're receiving power from your generator you can kind of pick and choose which breaker but you kind of want to turn on. Um, so we'll go ahead and turn on our garage lights. So from there, we can see again, uh, this is all powered from the generator. Uh, so let's say you want, you don't need full equipment, kitchen, um, Hot water, so water heater. Yeah, you probably won't probably want that on. We'll go ahead and kick that on, and then probably your AC. Um, you know, AC and your heater. So you'll kick that on. Keep yourselves warm, you know. And then we'll go over to our. Thermostat. Oh, it should kick on. And there we go. And I feel the air kicking in too. So, um, so it's always good to have kind of like a backup. And then you can kind of pick and choose uh, which breakers you kind of don't want to use. So if you absolutely need to use your your stove or what have you, you know, you can simply kind of balance out, turn off what you don't, what you're not using turn on what you want and it also kind of depends on uh, the size of the generator you have so if you I have a 
It's like a 10K generator, so you can pretty much power three, three quarters of the house um, with no issue. Uh, extra fuel cans, you'll definitely need those. Um, but yeah, definitely a good Definitely something good that everyone should probably have um, in case of emergencies. So we can start switching these on. Bye-bye.